Hello, today I want to show you the hardware parts of my little radio frequency project. First of all, there is the interface board with an Anaren A1101R088 radio module. The radio module is based on the Texas Instruments CC1101 transceiver chip and works in the 868 MHz band. Also included on the radio module is the antenna, which you can see here, so you don't need to care about this. The interface board costs about 30 euros. Why do I use this expensive interface board instead to directly use the radio module? The answer is, I'm not good at soldering and these chips nowadays are pretty tiny. The radio module comes as a so-called so LGA, land grid array, which is a type of surface mount packaging for integrated circuits, having a square grid of contacts on the underside of the package. So I think, beside major experience in soldering, you also need special equipment like a rework station. So let's have a nearer look to this. You can see the header sockets here. Actually, it's pretty tiny. Second, to connect this interface board to the Raspberry Pi, I created my own adapter board as PCB. You can see the header connectors here that will connect to the Anaren interface board. Here on the side, you can see the connectors to the Raspberry Pi's GBIO headers. The main task of this adapter board is to connect the pins of the Anaren radio module with the respective pins of the Raspberry Pi's GBIO pins. Let's have a look at the back side. I did the layout in Eagle and it looks like this. Now let's plug this together. Okay, then it looks like this. And finally, our Raspberry Pi comes into place and it, it fits here on the GPIO headers. Here we are. If you like this video, you can follow my blog at wolfgangklink.wordpress.com. Thanks for watching this video. Bye bye.